Have you ever wondered about the role of female arousal in the grand scheme of reproduction? It's a topic often overlooked, yet it holds a fascinating complexity and an important function. Our journey starts with the anatomy. What's intriguing is the striking similarities between male and female erectile tissues, both hailing from the same embryonic origin. The penis and the clitoris, for instance, share a common structure, each composed of erectile tissue. Digging deeper into the female anatomy, we find the clitoris, which primarily consists of erectile tissue. This organ has leg-like extensions known as the crura, which arise from the pubic bones. These crura unite to form the body of the clitoris, a structure analogous to the shaft of the penis. At the apex, we find the glans clitoris, a highly sensitive area that plays a key role in sensation and initiating erection. Now, how does an erection begin? It can be through tactile stimulation, which sends signals through the pudendal nerve to sacral spinal cord levels. Reflexively, these signals influence the internal erectile tissue of the clitoris, with minimal intervention from the brain. However, when tactile stimulation pairs with psychological arousal, the brain's role becomes more significant, converging signals to amplify the erectile response. Upon stimulation, nitric oxide is released within the erectile tissue, causing vasodilation. This allows more blood flow, leading to engorgement and erection. While female erection and climax aren't strictly necessary for sperm transfer, they can assist by increasing vaginal tightness and promoting sperm transport. During female climax, the rhythmic contractions of the pelvic floor muscles can propel sperm towards the uterus. This process is further aided by uterine contractions and the release of oxytocin. As a result, natural insemination through intercourse may enhance fertility compared to artificial methods, partially due to the physiological responses during female climax. Furthermore, Regular enjoyable intercourse leading to climax can increase the chances of successful reproduction, underlining the multifaceted role of arousal in reproductive success. In wrapping up, it's clear that understanding the complexities of sexual arousal and its physiological implications underscores its importance in reproductive processes. While not strictly essential, Female arousal and climax can significantly contribute to successful reproduction, shedding light on the intricacies of human sexuality and reproduction.